And with that splash begins heat number three of five in the men's final swim here in Rome, Italy, World Cup number four. In lane number one, Michalik from the Czech Republic, Krungolkas in Lithuania in lane two, David Svoboda of Czech Republic in lane three, in lane four from Poland, Marcan Horbash, Ilya Frolov from Russia in lane five, Pavlo Kurpalanski from the Ukraine in lane six, Christopher Patz from France in lane seven, and Yahor Lapo out of Belarus is in lane number eight. Just over 50 meters gone. Our current leader, Ilya Frolov, former world champion, taking a sizable lead at 75 meters. He is more than a body length and a half out in first place. In second place from France, Christopher Pate. And just on his inside is Pavlo Kurpolanski of the Ukraine. Coming up to the midway mark at the wall, it is definitely Frolov. Now on three body lengths out in first place. Right behind him, Pavlo Kurpolanski in lane six. And on the opposite side of Frolov, Marchan Horbash, winner from Mexico. Now 130 meters gone in the 200 meter race. Coming down to the third and final turn, Frolov continues to pull away. And now it is a three-way tie for second place. Kripalanski, Horbash, and Svoboda all in second. Frolov makes his final turn and now less than 50 meters to go in this heat. It is Frolov by more than three body lengths out in first place. Second place, Marchan Horbash has made a tremendous move up, move up into second from about fourth. And just to his inside in lane three is David Svoboda of the Czech Republic. Under 25 meters to go, it is Frolov who's now starting to falter and they are catching up. Ilya Frolov out in first place. Marchan Horbash working hard to catch up. And now inside of 10 meters, coming to the wall, it is Frolov first. Horbash in second place along with David Svoboda of the Czech Republic. And here are the lane assignments. In lane number one from Great Britain, this is Sam Wheel. In lane number two from Italy, Luigi Quarto. From Hungary in lane number three, Robert Nemeth. Then in lane number four from Korea, Dong Su Park. In lane five, Dimitri Meliak from Belarus. Libor Capolini from the Czech Republic in lane six. Federico Giancamilli from Italy in lane seven. And Dmitro Kurpalanski of the Ukraine is in lane number eight. They're at 25 meters. And the early lead, Libor Capellini in lane number six from the Czech Republic. Coming up to the first turn, keep in mind this is four lengths of a 50 meter pool. And at the turn it is definitely Capellini. Anyone's guess who's in second. Capellini pushes off strong, he's now a full body length out into first place. In second seems to be a three-way battle between Nemeth, Park, and Meliak. Capolini still out in first place, coming up to the 50 or 100 meter mark. It is Libor Capolini with the lead at the half mark coming into the wall at 100 meters. There's the turn, Capolini, and now making up some ground in lanes three and four. That's Nemeth and Park of Hungary and Korea, respectively. Capolini out in front but not as far his lead is now less than a full body length so there's Libor Capolini out in first Robert Nemeth of Hungary Dong Sung Park and Dimitri Meliak close behind coming up to 150 meters this is where it all starts to happen Libor Capolini at the wall there's the turn Capolini out in first in second place in lane three four and five there's Robert Nemeth, Dong Soon Park, and Dimitri Meliak. This is the last link. It is Lee Moore Capolini out in first still. Capolini hanging on to his lead, but is starting to dwindle. It's Lee Moore Capolini. Now a half a body length out in lane number three. That's Robert Nemeth of Hungary now making a move. But Dimitri Maliak has already dug in as well. Capolini will take this heat. It is Lee Moore Capolini coming into the wall. There it is, Capolini. And at the wall in second place. Boy, that is too close to call. It'll either be Robert Nemeth or Dmitry Maliak. And third, if it's not one of those two, it'll be Dong Sung Park of Korea. Now comes the fifth and final heat, the fastest of the heats. Don't blink, you'll miss this one. In lane number one, Igor Bondarov of Russia. In lane number two from Great Britain, Nicholas Woodbridge. Adam Moroshi of Hungary in lane number three. 
current Olympic and world record holder in the swim for modern pentathlon, Amra El Jaziri from Egypt is in lane number four. From Italy, Auro Francesini in lane five. And in lane number six, Bruno Merrill from France. And in lane number eight from Japan, Shinichi Tomi. And that is a clean start. We are off into the final heat here in the swimming in Rome. Coming up already to 25 meters is Tomi from Japan with a very marginal lead at the early sunset. Tomi in lane eight with just an arm's reach out over Amr El Jaziri. He will not hang on to that lead for long. Now coming up to the 50 meter mark, El Jaziri doing what he does best and taking over the swim. El Jaziri at the turn. It is Amr El Jaziri of Egypt with the lead now after 50 meters. In lane number five in second place, Francesini of Italy. And in third, just to the inside, in lane number three. This is Adam Moroshi of Hungary. Way up into lane number two, Nicholas Woodbridge has made some dramatic moves. Wood Woodbridge coming on equal with uh, El Jaziri right now, coming into the half mark at 100 meters. There's the turn. Just a split second out in front is Admiral El Jaziri of Egypt. Nicholas Woodbridge right on his heels. In fact, he's more like on his shoulder. This is the closest race for Al Jazeera we've seen in a long time. It is Amra Al Jazeera with a very slim lead over Nicholas Woodbridge of it, or excuse me, of Great Britain. Now coming down to the last turn, this will be 150 meters. Amra Al Jazeera still holding on to a very slim margin. Amra Al Jazeera, there it is at the wall. Amra Al Jazeera and Great Britain's Nicholas Woodbridge, that fast. In third place, right between them in lane number three, that's Adam Moroshi of Hungary. This is likely how it'll turn out at the finish. So now 25 meters to go. It is Amr Al Jaziri, and he is really struggling to hold on to this lead. Nicholas Woodbridge is digging in and pulling up. Down inside of 10 meters now. It is still Amr Al Jaziri. Nicholas Woodbridge is working really hard in lane number two. Amr Al Jaziri will take it. It is Amr Al Jaziri at the wall. Nicholas Woodbridge. And then in lane number three for third place, Adam Moroshi of Hungary.